All right, so it's your boy Vader's is on the rising today. I'm with Navido. How you doing today, G? Yo, good. I'm real good. How are you? Bro, I'm cooling. I'm tired as fuck. Trying to get these interviews out. You know the vibes, bro. Uh-huh. Shit, so what's going on with you, G? Shit, just been working. Got a tape about to come out. Feel me? Regular shit. Trying to try work. Get as much shit out as possible. Or I ain't mad at you. It's not supposed to be. Just keep working. Thanks. So, shit. Now I'm saying, let's just, like, before we get into, like, anything or whatever, let's just, like, go into your whole backstory, origins, and shit. So, like, uh, where you, so where you from, bro? From Hamilton Hill. Scratching New York. Okay, I was about to say, where is that? I ain't even gonna lie. We on Hamilton Hill right now. Oh, okay, yeah. I bet. We in the heart of the trenches, you feel me? Okay. Real homicide hill shit. Homicide. Yeah. And uh, could you tell me, like, what's it like growing up, Hamilton? Shit. What's it like growing up? It's really, it's really like how it is everywhere. You feel me? Simple shit. Basic shit. Niggas running around doing bad shit. Just coming up learning shit. You feel me? Like, niggas don't got no role models for real. Niggas, niggas look up to the drug dealers. Niggas look up to the niggas like that. You feel me? But feel me, just just got going with life the way it is. Or and like someone like with like you, like you know what I mean? Like, how do you like start getting into music? Let's start there. So music, I always used to, I used to always try to make music. Probably like. For like fourth grade, fifth grade niggas writing little little raps. Never really took it serious though. And then my pops, I found out I was rapping probably like seventh grade. That first nigga, like my first track, my first track, A Lot of Pain, that shit probably still on SoundCloud somewhere. I record that shit on a TV. Like no cap. I record that shit, had the computer hooked up to the TV. I ain't even have a mic, just record that shit straight through TV speakers, no cap. And then, Fuck, shot a video, shot my first video. My dad paid for my first video. That shit's still on YouTube too. It's rubbing off the paint remix, you feel me? Did that shit, it's going up a little bit. So I kept going with it. Over time, I got a passion for the music. I still got a passion for the music. That's why I'm working every day. But yeah, that's that's how I got into the music. All right, so the music, cause, oh, so, so, if the audience, the audience, because the audience doesn't know this, but me and you know this, and we were just talking about this off camera. Uh-huh. So you came to me a while back, um, a while back. It was like a few months ago. And you had uh, first like sent me um, your music. And I originally said no. I, I, want, I, say, I say this because a lot of people, Niggas think I'm fake. I ain't fake. I keep it a thousand. I don't know. I just gotta, I gotta keep it a thousand. Yeah, that's a fact. Yeah, you know what I mean. So, um, just talking about that, like, I just want to say I think it's cool that you as an individual like didn't like feel some kind of way or like you're like a prime example of like the type of niggas that like are respected. You know what I mean when it comes to like media and just like people like myself. You know what I mean. You know you don't take things like harsh or nothing. So. I appreciate that. And now look where we sure. are now. Sure. You know what I mean? Like months later, out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? So like with your music, just talking about that, you know what I mean? I see your music videos. I don't see as many though. Like um, I think the last one I saw was a while ago. It was like from a while ago. Feel me? But like um, I saw that Rami had like put it together and shit. What's your relationship like with him? Me and Robin got a great relationship. He really, he shot, he done shot all my videos. Every single video I done shot with him with Robin. Feel me? But um, we getting closer though. Like it used to just be, it used to just be a business relationship. You feel me? I just shoot with him. He edited it, sent to me, whatever. But now I'm like, I ain't dropped no video recently. I'm about to start dropping videos though. Like we, we've been chopping it up more and I've been getting more like, more in on what I want in the videos and shit like that. Getting more behind the creative process. So yeah, we cool. Or 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 and like when you like make these songs and shit, like what's like the vibe that you need when you go into the studio? Shit. 
I ain't gonna lie. I don't even, I don't really go to studios no more. When I do go to studios, I'm probably like out of town, probably Atlanta or some shit, probably out of town, Cali or some shit, just, just go to the studio because I have to. But when I'm here, I go to the studio sometimes. Really, I just, I just need to get high. That's it. And I just go in the booth, do what I do. But really, like, I don't go to the studio no more. I just be in the crib because I got the studio in the crib now. So really, I just, I record all day, every day. I wake up, get straight to it. You feel me? I don't even really need a vibe. Or, get hot, sip some drink, cold. So like with that, like, do you feel like, um, like we on Hamilton, we're on Hamilton Hill. Like, do you feel like it's like hard to kind of like pop out and make like music videos? Like, you know what I'm saying? Cause like people just, you never know, you know what I'm saying? In the streets or you just be chilling. You just be like focused on making music. I just be chilling, focused on making music. I ain't really, I ain't worried about none of that. I can shoot a video wherever I want to. But it's really like I don't really be finding no spots to shoot music videos. There ain't really no spots. You feel me? Like I gotta go somewhere else to shoot. I can't really shoot around here. I don't shot everywhere there is to shoot around here. Oh, so if you like made another one, it'd be like, didn't I just see that nigga? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, trying, yeah. I'm trying to start making movies. I'm trying. I might start going out of town to shoot videos and shit. So you said that you had like travel, you said like in Atlanta, you've been to Atlanta before? Facts, Atlanta, Cali, Miami, all types of places. Or what's that like? I don't be traveling like that. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, that shit is way better. Like when I'm home, shit just be regular. But when I'm out of town, that shit is vibe, you feel me? Go to Cali, I was just in Cali with um, Almighty J. Probably know who that is, Almighty J, Black Boy JB. Feel me? I be cooling with a couple famous niggas or whatever. That shit don't really mean nothing to me, but you feel me? I'm at town. I'm cooling with niggas that's actually got something going on in the music business, music industry. You feel me? Yeah. So, like, how did you, like, get your name? Shit. So, probably, like, middle school. Middle school niggas came up with Vito. For my real name, my real name, Nairi. So, just took the Nye. Nye Vito. Oh, okay. Or. Ain't bad. I uh, honestly, as a person growing up, I ain't really uh. No, nah, I had a lot of friends. I ain't gonna sit here and cap and say, "Oh, I didn't have a lot of friends." Uh, I, I I knew a lot of people. There we go. I knew a lot of people, but I didn't have a lot of friends. So I never really had a nickname. Mm -hmm. Growing like growing up, never. Like when I think about it now, so like when the people, it's always cool to find out like how someone got their name, or how a rapper, you know what I'm saying, someone even got a nickname. You feel me? Like that's always like a cool thing. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. So let me let me ask you this: Like, are you big on like collaborating with like other like artists out here, or like do you keep it like very close knit? So I used to, I used to not want to collaborate with niggas. You feel me? I really I really learned that you you really gotta do that. You don't have to, but it's better to do that. But I used to not want to collaborate with nobody if it wasn't gang. Not doing the song with you, you gotta pay me, nigga. I'm not doing no song, but now I really opened up more, try to start collabing with niggas. That's not even necessarily bigger, but like all types of niggas. I just like collaborating now. Like I just um, I did a track with Cooley How much? I don't know if you know who that is, but that should come in soon. He sounds familiar. The the last part. I'm, I'll be yo. I'm I'm saying yo. I'll be so serious. Like if I don't know. I don't say I don't know, but cause that shit catch up with you. That shit uh, catch up with you. I got a um, I got a couple tracks with um, Lil Dump too. You fuck with Young Boy and shit, 4K Train shit. Oh okay. I'm about to drop those soon. How does how does it feel to um like be able? To, I know you said it don't really mean nothing to like know these people and stuff like that. But what does it feel like you know to know that you can like? Hit these people up, like contact them if you want to. You know what I'm saying? Or making music with with these people. What does that feel like? I mean, that shit like, like I said, that shit don't really mean nothing to me. But you feel me? I like I like building relationships with people. You feel me? Like say I'm out in Louisiana, I could I could hit folks up. I'm out in Atlanta, I could hit folks up. I'm out in Cali, I could hit folks up. I just like like networking. Or what's Cali like? I've been there one time. Cali's a movie. My son, my son splashes with me in Cali too. That shit is a movie. Cali, Vegas, all that shit a movie. 
Oh yeah, I met Chris Brown out there. No cap. Word. Hell yeah, I was in a mansion party with Chris Yo, Brown. Tell me about the picture, my nigga. Oh, this the is. Picture, all right, I got a story nigga. from niggas. All right, so niggas met Chris Brown, whatever, whatever. His, I don't know, I don't know his manager, or some shit, bodyguard, or some shit. Nigga was on dickhead timing. Feel me? Chris Brown, he a cool nigga. He is cool. Niggas dapped him up, whatever. Niggas is cool, man. Niggas about to take a picture with him. Niggas took a picture with him. His his manager, bodyguard, whatever, was like, nah, hold on, hold on, we're not doing pictures right now. Chris Brown, like, nah, it's cool, it's cool. We could, we could do it. I'm like, all right. He said, I'll take it. I give the nigga my phone, you feel me? Niggas take the picture. I leave the party. Probably like, probably like an hour or two later, niggas leave the party. Picture not even on my phone. Nigga ain't even really take the picture. Nigga pump fake with the picture. Oh, that's <laughs> crazy. Chris that, Brown? That shit had... Nah, not Chris like, Brown. Yeah. Or the bodyguard? Yeah, that was tough. The bodyguard didn't even take the photo? Yeah, he pump fake. He ain't really take Oh, it. nah. Like, niggas pose. He act like he was taking it. Everything. Nah, I would have had to do the it. selfie after he did that shit. <laughs> I wouldn't have trust that nigga. I don't care how that sound. Yeah, I would have had to get the man. selfie, bro, because... <laughs> said the selfie. Yeah, like don't worry, don't worry, I got it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take care of it, like, cause that's crazy. <laughs> nah, that you know what I'm saying, like, nah, that's some hating ass shit. Nah, yeah, that nigga was definitely hating. But he said that, he went back. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga was definitely hating that party. I ain't gonna lie, that party was probably one of the latest nights of my life. I ain't gonna lie, that shit was lit. And you, you feel me, niggas get extra cool points, cause niggas. Pulled up in the black truck with Almighty J and shit. <laughs> and niggas get extra cool points. All the all the IG bitches that niggas just double tapping they shit. We just we in there with all them bitches. Well, how did you how did you um come across like getting connected with Almighty J? My 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 folks, my um my cousin boyfriend. She um he um he cool with him. He be running with him and shit. So you feel me, niggas just went out to Cali. He was out there with him. Niggas be running with Almighty J, Block Boy, 600 Breezy, Free 600 Breezy too. Word, word, word. That's fire. You would never know. Yo, that's the crazy thing about it. Like, niggas will live in Albany, Troy's Connect. And, like, you never know what niggas is doing, bro. Like, people be like, oh, this shit whack out here. But, like, it's easy. It's kind of, it's pretty connected out here. Like, people really be connected out here and shit. Nah, fact, fact. Uh, niggas just not, niggas not, I don't know. Like you, using their uh, resources Sex. to their best ability, Sex. I would say. You know what I'm saying? So, like, who are, are there any, like, people that you listen to that are from out here, or you don't listen to nobody? Shit, I listen to gang. I listen to, nah, I'm not even just going to say gang. I'm going to say niggas' names. Like, I listen to Splash Vito. I listen to Moolah, K Vito. Listen to Tone Y and G, Dev Gusto. I listen to all types of niggas. I listen, I listen to Glow, I listen to fucking Kai Glow. It's not all types of niggas. I also listen to. I don't really. I listen to DTB sometimes. Uh, I don't really listen to nobody else. I don't think so. Word, word, word. Yeah, I I got like a select few of people that I like listen to. Okay. Like I listen, I listen to DTB. Know what I mean? Uh -huh. I listen to um, I listen to Wiz. I pay attention. Wiz Mac. I I pay attention to um, Yo Trap. I don't listen to him like that, but I know he on too. Yeah, he, I be seeing his shit. He weird. I don't I don't really listen to him either. I, I, Yo I Trap is I, going crazy. Yeah, yeah. He's going crazy. I listen to um, I listen to Cushy. That's I listen. Yeah, to I listen. To, I listen to him now too. That's I listen to. I, really I listen know. to Glow. I listen to Glow Heavy. Shit. Yeah, it's, a, it's like a select few, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But, yeah, and it's funny, like, some people, I'll ask people, and then niggas want to ask me and shit. Like, nigga, my, my opinion ain't the only, my opinion don't matter as much as y'all niggas want to make, try to make it seem like it is. It don't, uh -huh. like, it don't. Like, I, I just be saying how I feel, you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know, niggas. Be, <laughs> it ain't about me. <laughs> it ain't about me. But uh, yeah, bro. So like, moving on from that. Now nah, I'm saying, you see the whole drill wave going on and shit. You fucking with that shit? I I don't fuck with the drill shit at all, bro. I don't like that shit, bro. 
I feel like that shit easy to make, and I feel like everybody trying to make it. I feel like it's too much drill. It's too much. It's too much like everybody sounded the same? Yeah, facts. I don't really feel me. I don't really rock with that shit. Yeah, how do you feel about it starting to move upstate? It's cool. I don't I'm, I don't hate on drill, man. It's just not my type of shit, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Do you listen to like Southern music more or like other like areas of music? Like different, like like they like say it'd be like Florida or like like you said Louisiana or Cali, yeah. West Coast. Yeah. You like listen to other people and shit. Hell yeah, I listen to like te- Texas artists and shit like that. Like niggas like Can Can or like Summers. I don't know if you know who that is. But... No, nah, the only nigga I think I know that's from Texas is like Peso Peso. Okay. Sauce Walker. Okay. Um, nah, them niggas not even know from Texas. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, I'm. That's what I'm saying. I don't even know if they're from Texas. Like, yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I just know the niggas be. I know the niggas from like over there, like Arizona. I think they from like somewhere like that. They from, they from over there. They they the over there niggas. Yeah, I'm. You know I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> they the over there niggas. Uh, Take a hell yeah. Take I don't like that nigga because because um. One time my girl said she had a crush on him. <laughs> so I don't fuck with that nigga. Nah, I fuck with TK. I fuck with TK. Fuck with that nigga. TK a big inspiration. I ain't gonna lie. TK a big inspiration. My girl, my girl fuck with the guys out. My girl listen to music out here. I don't care. She be, I don't care. I don't think nothing of it. But what? She say, what she say? It's like a, a big time like rapper nigga. I'm like, what the fuck? She had a crush. That, that shit kind of hurt me. I ain't gonna lie. But TK. What did you guys say? My first, um, probably like after my first song, I did a little EP. That shit was called like Three for Three. I did like three Take A beats on that shit, no cap. Like, uh, so my first song was Take A remixes. All uh, right. You listen to Baby Tron? Hell yeah. Baby Tron going crazy right now. Hell yeah, I listen to Baby Yeah, he's going stupid. I ain't even going to lie. I ain't even going to lie. He's going crazy. I remember, I remember when I first um, listened to that nigga. Uh, I used to shoot a lot of concerts, like photos. I never got pictures of Baby John. I never that nigga from like DMV, I think. Nah, that nigga from um Detroit. Yeah. That's the DMV. Yeah. Detroit not in right. DMV. Nah. nah. Detroit, Michigan. Nah, DMV. But it's Michigan. DC, Maryland, Maryland, Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Right? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, DC. <laughs> really? I thought we thought DMV. I'm about to tell y'all some real shit. This like, see that I can admit when I'm wrong. You want to know why I always thought DMV was from like Detroit? Why? Because that's where like motor vehicle, like the um, <laughs> okay, <laughs> nah, like the General Motors. That's yeah, where like the big yeah. like motor companies is. Yeah. So I'm like DMV. Okay, that's where like all the car places is. At least back in history, that's what they used to be. But um, yeah, I always I always put the two and two together. But now I know it's you said DC. What else? Maryland and Virginia. Yeah, DC, Maryland, Virginia. What the yo shit is switching up, bro. I'm What's about to by nigga Gunu. Oh, Gunu, he just passed, right? Yeah, DMV legend right there. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting old, bro. I'm about to be 27. Shit getting y'all niggas got all these acronyms and shit. Young <laughs> young niggas going crazy. But like going on from that and shit. <laughs> you see what's going on with like um Yo, I yo, you like the fifth nigga, bro. I can't get this shit out of my brain, cause I listen, I listen to this nigga all the time. So I always, I, lately, I've been asking everybody since it came out and shit. But um, you see what's going on with like uh, G Herbo and shit. What you think hell about yeah, that, bro? G Herbo used to be my favorite artist too. That nigga, was, yeah, hell yeah, that nigga used to be my favorite artist. Nah, that's some goofy shit, but I feel like Kyra on some hate and shit for real. I feel like, nah, he shouldn't have went to an interview and said all that. Could have called the nigga up on his phone. Uh, I don't know, but her ass is goofy too, though. Real goofy for that shit. Yeah, because if you let it get to that, then you kind of like. Hell yeah, if it's you know going to that, then you've been in the wrong one. Like, you got you to go fix that. Word. <sighs> Word. So, yeah, going on from that. Talking about you ever that shit is I don't know that shit is crazy, that nigga uh I don't know bro I I believe Kyra I ain't gonna lie I mm. believe him too I ain't gonna lie I guess it's like damn why you ain't calling nigga but it's like you can only call a nigga so much nah yeah that's facts so 
That shit crazy. Yo, the whole social media game crazy. You saw that shit with Kanye too? Nah, what happened with Kanye? I be seeing a lot of shit with Kanye. So Yo, they, just, they, 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 just, they just banned that nigga off of... They ain't banned him. I ain't gonna say that. Yeah, and drag it, but they, oh, they, they took him off. They took yeah, him off Instagram that. for like 24 hours. I seen that. Yeah, I seen that. Type shit. shit. That. Yeah, but they you, took him off some show too. They took him off the Grammys. Yeah. Oh, shit. They, they, they did do the that too. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, what you think? What you think about that nigga uh, banging his wife? That shit crazy. Yeah, <laughs> <No. laughs> that shit crazy. <laughs> that shit crazy. I know. I, I know. I just came crazy saying that shit. That shit is crazy. Though. I think it's so. Nigga skeet. He winning though. Nigga skeet winning. Yeah, yeah. nigga skeet. Yeah. I'm Team Ye. I ain't gonna lie. Ye, my favorite artist of all time. What? Hell yeah, thanks. Would you, would you say he give you like inspiration to making music and shit? Uh, yeah, hell yeah. But you you don't see it in my music. Mm. But hell yeah. Word, word, word. Yeah, bro. I wish that nigga well, man. Cause I don't know. I don't think he come back for you. Like, nigga, you saw a text man, nigga said, I'm with your wife right now. <laughs> you said what? Hell yeah, that, that, that nigga Kanye, that nigga Kanye posted said, I don't even want her, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nigga said, I don't even want her, bro. That's just crazy, bro. He's like, where you at right now? He's like, in the bed with your wife. That shit is crazy, bro. Yeah. Pull up the Sunday service. Yeah. Nigga said, pull up the Sunday service. Nah, that's crazy. Pull up the Sunday service is crazy. Hell no. Fuck that shit. That shit. Bro. I don't know what I would do, bro. He wanted to do that nigga in the church. Yeah, that shit is crazy. But like going on going going off of that shit. What you got planned for like in the future and shit, like, you know what I mean? Like with uh you know what I'm saying, with your music music wise and shit. Shit, I'm about to go crazy with the visuals. Probably like I ain't dropping like two weeks, but before that, you feel me, I was dropping every day, so I'm about to get back to that. I'll be dropping every day. I'll be dropping a little single every day. But um, oh, okay. I'm about to go crazy with the visual, so I'm about to be trying to drop a visual. I want to say every day. That's too much. Probably like probably a video a week. Probably about to go off that. I've been dropping a tape every month, too. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to drop a tape this month, but next month I'm going to drop a tape. Probably got an album coming soon. Probably by the end of the year, probably an album. You feel me? Um, yeah, hella tapes, hella visuals, and yeah, album. That's it, though. Or, or, or. So let me ask you this, because like, I already told you I was going to ask you about it and shit. Uh-huh. So I was talk- when, I, when we was talking off camera and shit, you was talking, you asked me how, why I hit you up. Yo, what what's up with, yo, what's up with that lie, bro? <laughs> what's going with that shit, bro? You don't got an answer, but I'm, I'm asking you. Sure. Yeah, I'm going to answer for sure. It's just like, I don't know, niggas be... I ain't gonna say no names, but niggas know who they is. Niggas just be, they be throwing a little sneak dissing and shit. You feel me? I don't really respond to that shit. Like I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get away from that beat shit. That shit corny, but like niggas be throwing a little post at nigga and shit. I don't say shit. So one day niggas just got fed up with that shit. Man, why? I had to tell niggas the truth. Like yeah. niggas used to be scamming my wrestlers. <laughs> <laughs> niggas, niggas ain't have <laughs> shit. We in my grandma crib right now. Niggas ain't have shit. My grandma let them come here and eat. Niggas used to play my Xbox, my PlayStation. Niggas used to steal my wrestlers. I used to go to niggas crib, see my wrestlers like, yo, what's Wait, up? Wait, you talking about actual? Hell, like, nigga, I had a whole yes. thing, nigga. <laughs> when, I, when I was younger, I was in the WWE, you feel me? I had a whole bin full of wrestlers, you feel me? I had every wrestler. Yeah. Every, niggas used to be taking my wrestlers. No I place, used to have that shit, too. Nigga, I, to I love them shit. I used to have all the wrestlers, all the rings, all the cages, everything. That nigga fuck around steal my whole fucking ring. I'm like, where my ring go? And it break through on purpose, like you could break through and shit. Hell yeah, oh yeah. All type oh, of shit. Man. Yeah, the shit stone like, cold jacket, you could take <laughs> yeah, y'all, nah, don't don't get me started, bro. The niggas like, don't be from where I really grew up with for real. Yeah. It would be like that all the time, but you feel me? I'm not even trying to beef with these niggas. These niggas just hate niggas for no reason. Even when niggas was cool. I would peep niggas do a little hate and shit because niggas would be hating on the shit I got because niggas don't got the shit I got. Um, that shit weird, but fuck it. Well, well, let me ask you this because you know, you know, let me let me ask you because I gotta be po- I gotta be I gotta be a positive one, you know what I mean? Since I'm the the the, the mediator, I guess or whatever the fuck you want. Y'all niggas want to call me whatever, but 
Like, do you think y'all could ever like be cool? Is it ever, or are you just like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think. You feel me? Like, nah. I right, let's say just first. Niggas will never be cool. Niggas could not be beefing. Like, oh, like civil. Like, yeah, niggas. Could, niggas could. We do what we do. They do what they do. But niggas not gonna be cool. Hell no. Mm-hmm. Or yeah. stole the wrestlers. <laughs> you keep that. Like, yeah, I'll be mad yeah. lie, cause I ain't gonna lie when I was. When I, I know it ain't just that, but when I was a. Like when I was a kid and shit, I I had that saying, I had a toy box full of toys. Fucking my dad bought them shits for me for Christmas and shit. I remember my cousin, he used to like, yo, let me borrow this, bro. Let me borrow this. Uh, uh, uh. He was a little bigger than me too, like, you know what I'm saying? So I just, like, you know what I mean? Like, come back, break my shit. Like, now, now my dad find the broken toys and shit, get in trouble. Like, he used to, or I say no, he still take him, come back, broken toys and shit. Crazy. So nah, he used to, that was my cousin, bro. <laughs> that was my cousin, bro. He used to No nigga niggas was my cousin. Niggas oh, what? Was my cousin. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Uh, nah, that's my bad. Damn. That's it. Right, nah. nah, that was really my cousin though. Like Juwan. That was my that was my nigga, bro. Like, I ain't got to lie. I don't got to lie. Like, I ain't never lied. You feel me? I told the whole government. You know what I'm saying? I am a real ass nigga. You will find that nigga on Facebook, bro. Ask that nigga about the rest of us, bro. You know we, got, we got similar stories, bro. But shit. <laughs> or, the, or, the, or the wrestler part. Shit. But like, um, yeah, bro. You got like anything that... Anything that uh, your fans and like the audience can like um, shit anticipate from you? Shit, tapes, videos, just music. That's that's really it. Really, a lot of features. Could expect some features, some bigger features. You feel me? I ain't really gonna say too much, but I said this in my last interview too. I got some 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 surprise big big features coming. Or that's fire. That's fire. And I respect it, G. And saying on a, on a note between, uh, just like me and you, like, yeah, bro, definitely keep making music, bro. Like, I, I think I said that in the beginning when we first talked. Like, I'm going to definitely be tuning in and just watching out. So you better, like, keep your word. You know what for me? sure, for sure. All right? Because I'm going to call you out on that. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, thanks for having me. And um hope y'all niggas stay safe. Shit. And uh, that being said, it's your boy Vader. And we out.